Back in the day, Travis Barker was not known for marrying Kardashians? No. He was still known as one of those naked guys in Blink-182. Hopefully, technically, he still is. But every time I turn on the news, it's always like, Travis Barker and the Kardashians. I'm like, no. But, um, yeah. So, uh, back in the day, I did a speech on Blink-182 for a speech class. It was about the What's My Age Again video and how they're now more famous because they're now known as those naked guys. The conclusion of my speech was, they can now afford clothes, they just choose not to wear them. It was very in-depth, you guys. And um, the fire alarm went off, so we all had to go outside. And then we came back in, and my teacher, Mr. Majewski, was like, what are we doing? He's like, oh yeah, Sarah was up there talking about those naked guys, and the fire alarm went off. And I was like, that's right, Mr. Majewski, because it was just too hot. It was too hot, baby. You got to run for shelter. You got to run for shade. And that was Coolio because we got to coolio it down because it's just too hot. And I can't sing, but uh, I'm trying, so yeah. So I um, hope you guys heard of the band Goldfinger. Like Travis Barker played drums on one of their albums, and I just bring it up because that's what we call a transition. But um, yeah. And uh, they also had this song called Mabel, and it was like, Mabel, she's the bomb. And I was thinking, it was like, the bomb? That's like the bee's knees phrase of the 1990s. But I was like... Can you really say the bomb a lot nowadays? Like, what if I kept being up here and be like, you guys, you gotta go to the Sandman Comedy Club because it's the bomb. This place may get evacuated quicker than my Blink-182 speech. <laughs> so uh, let's not try that out. <laughs> Back in the day, Mike from MXPX was not a wallflower and goldfinger, no. He was still known as a chick magnet in MXPX. Hopefully, technically, he still is. And those were song titles with bands that hope maybe you didn't get that one, but just so you know, that's what that was. So um, I don't know if you guys have heard of the band The Briggs. They're not super well known, but if The Briggs were to be super well known, they'd have to change the name from The Briggs to The Bigs. That's right, guys. <laughs> And you can uh, groan at that one, too. Oh, 